Thanks to SolidWorks for their continued support of fun. Get SolidWorks for free for your team at solidworks.edu slash first. Welcome to week three of Open Alliance Highlights, brought to you by Team 6328. In this video, we will cover some of the most innovative, creative, and notable Open Alliance posts from the past week. To start, Team 95, the Grasshoppers, have decided on using a pneumatically actuated gripper on their jointed arm to score cones and cubes. They have also been manufacturing and preparing a lot of parts for the robot's assembly. Next is Team 1757, the Wolverines, who have decided on a three linkage arm and did a lot of programming work. They tested arm control on a small jointed arm, simulated arm movement, did some April type vision work, and path planning with advantage scope. Team 2713, Red Hawk Robotics, did a lot of CAD work this past week. They designed a swerve drivetrain and a tilted elevator with a 4 bar intake on the carriage, and they're exploring two different options for their end effector. On the software side, they're using Path Planner for their autonomous and have simulated their elevator controls. Next up is Team 3749, Team Optics, who really jumped ahead getting a fully assembled robot done by the end of week 2. This past week, they've been mainly doing a lot of testing and practice with their swerve drivetrain. Team 3847 Spectrum has been doing intake testing on their Alphabot. They found a pretty successful design which can intake cones, standing or tipped, and cubes. Team 5987 Galaxia did a lot of prototype testing, trying out a ground intake for both cones and cubes, a free spinning gripper to reorient cones, and a small double jointed arm. Team 6328 Mechanical Advantage has done a lot of software work regarding April Tag Detection and Pose Estimation on Advantage Scope. On the design side, we have made most of our final decisions regarding the robot's geometry and mechanisms, so we are now working on getting the CAD finished. Last but not least, Team 7407 The Wired Boards have finished their robot CAD, which includes a ground intake, compact pivoting elevator, and end effector on a wrist. They have also developed an interesting fork for buddy climbing on the charge station. Lastly, they made significant progress with the robot's assembly. That's it for this week's Open Alliance highlights. Thank you to all the Open Alliance teams, and see you next week. This video on First Updates Now is made possible by viewers like you and also the following sponsors. SolidWorks is free for first teams. Over 80% of U.S. engineering schools and 370,000 plus companies use SolidWorks to design great products. SolidWorks can help you design a great robot on desktop or on the cloud. Go to SolidWorks.com first to register your team. FRC Premiere Night is back on Saturday, February 25th. Submit a unique video showcasing your team's charged up robot progress by Thursday, February 23rd at First Updates Now slash Premiere 23. Premiere Night is a great way to engage with the community. Get more information and submit your video at firstupdatesnow.com slash Premiere 23. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell to stay up to date on our new videos. Keep the conversation going and provide your input to our content. Watch our live shows at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now. Join our Discord at discord.gd forward slash first updates now. And check out Fun FTC on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And First Updates Now on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter.